home. This is home. The first real home that Kyle Snyder has had since being placed in foster care when he was three years old. I think for me, growing up in foster care, being bounced from place to place was the hardest. And I've been here for two years, and I think this is the longest I've ever really stayed in a place. Kyle works full time, goes to school full time, and pays all of his bills on time. Two years ago, he was on the verge of being homeless. Before I got in the Opportunity Passport, I was kind of the person that lived paycheck by paycheck. Um, used to struggle a lot. Kyle turned his life around with help from a program called Opportunity Passport, available to young people ages 14 to 26, currently or formally in foster care. The program, developed by the Jim Casey Youth Opportunities Initiative and overseen by the nonprofit Jobs for Maine's graduates, teaches kids to budget, set goals, establish credit, and, says Debbie Bichard, who oversees the program, money saved by those young people is matched dollar for dollar up to $1,000 a year for things many young people need as they transition to adulthood. Tuition, rent, a laptop, medical expenses. It's not just a giveaway. They really have to work hard to be able to save their portion of this purchase, and so there's um, there's a lot of success in that, and I, I see a lot of pride on the other side, like, you know, wow, I did this myself. I saved enough money to be able to buy my first car or pay, you know, help pay for uh, books for this semester. It's a good idea. That's why I agree with it. It's the kind of support parents often give their 20-something children. That's true. But when you grow up in foster care, as Mariah Trimble-Smith and her fiancé Mike LaPointe did, Calling mom or dad for a little financial help isn't an option. <laughs> and it's very scary because you, you don't know if you're going to be able to be successful. And there's no room for failure. It's on yourself. And if you fail, no one else is going to pick you back up. Mike and Mariah say Opportunity Passport provides a crucial safety net. They taught us how to budget. And you can ask Mike, you give me a penny and I can make like $5 out of it somehow. I got a bank account. I haven't had a bank account in like 10 years. Yeah, so it was pretty great. Last year, the program reached a milestone. Since 2004, the young people participating have saved and received matching funds totaling $1 million. That's a big step forward into a more secure financial future. In Portland, Susan Kimball, Portland Press Herald.